Well, I've been in the US for the last two months and I've bought cowboy boots like this. What is up from freezing cold Tokyo? I am here with <laughs> Konnichiwa! And we have an action packed day. Let's go! Yeah. Hot coffee from the vending machine. <laughs> so cold! So, there are five things that I want to do today. What do you want to do? I want to get a curry. That's already on my list. B. Oh, I can't believe that wasn't on my list. So first up is breakfast from a vending machine. Dan looks very lost here. What's on the menu? No idea, mate. No oh, idea. We'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. Yeah, the green, click the green one. Uh, the big green uh, button. Oh, that's takeaway. Which one? That one? Yeah, that one, yeah. That's not green. Oh, okay. that, that's green, isn't it? That's blue. <laughs> <laughs> I love doing this stuff, but it's always such a challenge. Ah. Alright, breakfast. So we came into this cool little random vending machine spot. This whole breakfast, I think it was like $3. Yours is the same, right? Yeah. Let's give it a shot. That was amazing. It was good? Delicious, man. Delicious. Delicious. Japanese breakfast, check. Yeah, that was an awesome breakfast. Now we are off to Weno. Weno, is that how we say it? Weno. Weno, to do some shopping. Need more cold weather clothes because it is freezing here. How do I get to Weno station? In the information Funnily enough, we actually both still have our rail cards from last year, so just top them up. Mine actually had a bit of balance on it, which is cool. Now, off. Did you? I had four yen. Four yen. <laughs> I had like 200 or 100 and something. All right, off to Weno. Okay, we have arrived at Weno. I love taking the subway here because you get such a cool view over the city. It's above ground most of the way and you get a really cool view over the city and this city just looks, it's so visually exciting everywhere you go. Come to calculate it, yeah. seriously. Uh, uh, 45. No, 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 I found four that I really liked and got a good price on them. I'm happy. Tell me about your cowboy boots then. Well, <laughs> well, I've been in the US for the last two months and I've bought cowboy boots like this. But I don't think I can wear them in Bangkok or Asia <laughs> at all. 
You can't wear them with me, period. <laughs> So next up what I wanted to do was to take a walk around the park. So there's a park right across the road from where we're shopping in Ueno. And I wanted to come check out. So the cherry blossom is starting. It's still a little early. It's still a bit cold. But you can see there's actually one behind me just here, which actually kind of surprised me. So we're going to take a walk around the park here and see what it's like and just have a little escape from the city. So I think, this, we came here last year, right? This yeah, is this is it. The we cherry walked blossom. down here, all this was like uh, cherry blossom all the way along. And it was really beautiful, right? Romantic. Romantic. <laughs> so we're still a little early, the cherry blossoms haven't come out yet. Another few weeks? Another few weeks, yeah, that's what's forecasted. Oh man, I love coming to places like this. Honestly, you forget that you're in the city and Tokyo is such a hectic city. So when you come to these little escapes, it's just so peaceful and so lovely. And we've been blessed with beautiful weather today. Oh, feeling good. So next up on my list of things to do and on Dan's list is a curry for lunch. And one of our favorite places is just up ahead. So this is Koko Ichibanya. It's one of my favorite places to come. It's a chain. They're basically all over Japan. And I tried it my first time here and I was blown away at how delicious it was. Well, so good. I'm home. I'm home. Mm. Oh yes. Awesome lunch. Japanese curry. Check. So we have come around to Shibuya Crossing, something you must do when you visit here in Tokyo. This place is, it's insane, honestly. So much fun. If you come to Tokyo, that is a bucket list item, something you must do. So the next thing I wanted to do, we can hopefully do nearby. And I wanted to get up somewhere really high, like a rooftop or something like that, and get a real nice view over the whole city. There's a, remember where that, there's a sky rooftop thing somewhere? One of these, like around here? Something. We tried to go last year and it was full, booked out. Public holiday, right? Public it was too busy. Holiday. Yeah, that was right. Today is the day. Oh no! Again, sold out. You must have to buy tickets for it or whatever. Plan our plans. <laughs> plan B. Plan B. So we have come around to Tokyo Plaza and the view from this place is insane. Check it out. What do you think of the rooftop, Dan? Incredible view. <laughs> Incredible view, but I'm exhausted. Yeah. <laughs> We've got one more thing left to do today on our list, and it's a fun one.
Cheers, mate. Cheers. <laughs> It's great to catch up. It's been a hot minute since we hung out. Dan's been a busy boy. Long time. Yeah, I've been, I've been, let me grab this and talk to you guys. I've been uh, in America for the last two months and a bit. That's expensive, really expensive. Been filming, doing a bit of a road trip. You'll see that, but it's not like a travel stuff. I think I'm gonna do a channel about like YouTube, about like the core stuff I do, but with a bit of like traveling across America. I'll, I'll let you guys know all about it when I've, uh, it's exciting. I've done it. Yeah, it's exciting. A lot of editing. <laughs> yeah. But I've seen I've seen bits of it and it looks amazing. So for us over the next three weeks, just over three weeks, we're doing a road trip all around Japan. This is our second day here in Tokyo. Actually I can't say that because this is my first day in Tokyo. Oh, yeah. We arrived late last night and today is our first proper day enjoying Tokyo. And tomorrow we hit the road for three weeks, driving all around the country. <laughs> I'm making a super long documentary, Dan's gonna be making some videos. It should be a whole lot of fun. No plan, not much of a plan. No plan, no plan. It's gonna be awesome.